Oh, okay, let's do it. Hey guys, this is Monica from LingoPie, and in this video, we are going to talk about how you can learn a new language by listening to music. I'm gonna show you how to turn great songs into effective language learning opportunities and which songs we recommend for learners of Spanish, Italian, French, German, Russian, Portuguese, Korean, and Japanese. So, by the end of this video, you will know how listening to music is proven to be a great language learning method. And you will have our recommendation for great songs to help you learn different languages. When you finished watching, just click on the link under this video for a free 7-day trial with LingoPy to get access to all movies, TV shows and features. You can stream more than 1500 shows in multiple languages, sign up for private classes with tutors, use dual subtitles, flashcards and so much more with LingoPy. And I want to tell you that we just launched the LingoPy Music and we are super excited for you guys to try out. So don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more useful information on language learning. Now, let's talk about learning languages. How can you learn languages through music? How many song lyrics do you think you have stored in your brain? Now, imagine if some of those lyrics you memorized were in a foreign language, rather than your own. It is time to unlock the potential of your lyric memory and start listening to songs in other languages. By doing so, you can learn thousands of new words and phrases, discover songs that you love in the language you're learning, and play them over and over until you can sing along. This is a super popular learning method with people who are learning English, and you can do the same with any other language. You can also use the Spotify feature that shows the lyrics or YouTube lyrics videos to help you pick up new words. The science of learning through music. Learning information through a song or a rhyme is a classic memorization technique applied by all schools. Just think about the ABC song, the days of the week song, the colors of the rainbow. Children learn these basic things through music and rhyme, and so they do. This is because listening to words with a rhythm or a rhyme can be a massive advantage for your memory. When your brain hears the tune, it begins to recite the information associated with it. And when you hear a word or phrase that's part of a rhyme, you will hear the next line of the song. Songs also use a lot of repetition, and repetition is another great tool for memorization and learning new words and phrases. Think about it. The more you hear the same words, the more they will be retained in your mind. If you're picking up words from a song but you don't understand the context, you can use the tone of the song and the music video to help you out. Great songs for learning Spanish. If you're looking for songs in Spanish that are easy to follow and understand, check out Volar by Álvaro Soler, Bailemos by Danny Fernandez, or you can get into any of the super popular songs by Bad Bunny that are all over Spain and Latin America, if you'd prefer to hear a Latin American accent and plenty of slang. And remember to check out the music videos for context and a chance to take a look into some Latin American culture. At LingoPie, one of our key values is encouraging people to immerse themselves in different cultures while they learn a new language. This provides a full and all-around learning experience. Listening to Spanish music from different Spanish-speaking countries is a great way to do this. You can learn the differences in culture, traditions, slang and politics through the music scene in various Hispanic countries. Great songs for learning Italian. Of course, when choosing Italian songs to listen to, you will think of the iconic Ponte Partiro by Andrea Bocelli, as well as the Bella Ciao, which was featured on La Casa de Papel, the Spanish Netflix show known as Money Heist in English. For a more modern sound, you can also check out Mio Giorno Pio Bello nel Mondo by Francesco Renga for some popular mid-2010s pop rap vibes. Or Italian Eurovision entry for 2019, Soldi, by Mahmoud. Now, this one is really catchy. Whatever Italian tune catches your attention, remember to note down useful vocabulary or words you don't understand so you can look them up later. It can also help to sing aloud to the song, as this will help your pronunciation and confidence with spoken Italian. 
great songs for learning French. For a beautiful and classic French sound, you can relax with Edith Piaf's Non Je Ne Regrette Rien or La Vie en Rose. Edith Piaf is not only an icon of French culture, but her pronunciation is lovely and quite easy to follow for beginners. For intermediate learners, a fun challenge can be the 70s punk song Sa Plan Pour Moi by Plastic Bertrand or the electric modern Alors on Dance by Belgian musician Stromae. In fact, you'll be on to a winner with any song by him. Remember that French language varies depending on the country. So, depending on whether you're learning French for use in France, Belgium or Canada, you should focus your musical choices on that country to tune your ear to the sounds. Great songs for learning Russian! If you're learning Russian and want to try out some pop music, you can listen to Higher by Miyusha, who is from Moscow. Or for a more classic folk song, check out one of the many versions of Kalinka, written by Ivan Larionov in the 1800s. This beautiful song is called The Snowball Tree in English, and it is great for practicing vocabulary to do with nature and plants. Finally, for a more lively rock song, check out What is Autumn by DDT. Great songs for learning Portuguese. If you love Europop, we recommend Salvador Sobral's Amar Pelos Dois, which won the Eurovision Song Contest for Portugal in 2017. For Brazilian Portuguese, you can try Trevo by Ana Vitória. Or, if you are in the party mode, you can listen to Você Partiu Meu Coração by Anita and Nego do Borel. Keep in mind that Brazilian Portuguese is quite different from European Portuguese. So, if you're learning Portuguese for use in Brazil, these songs will help you to tune into the differences. Great songs for learning Korean. How could you forget Gundam Style by Psy? The song that blew up the internet in 2012 and made us all want to learn Korean. Even if we didn't understand it, we all tried singing along to that tune. Now you can go back to it and look up the lyrics. In addition to this, you can get into the super popular K-pop scene. Starting with songs like DNA or Fire by BT. So there we have it, guys and girls. Now you know the benefits of learning languages while listening to music. And you have some great song recommendations to get the ball rolling on your journey. Learning languages through song is proven to be a highly effective method, as your brain naturally retains information better when it has a rhythm or a rhyme, and you hear words repeated a lot. On top of this, you can learn correct pronunciation, slang, you can know more about different cultures and several accents by listening to songs from other countries. And it's even more effective if you sing along. Language shadowing, which is when you repeat the words as they are said in the song, is a great tool for picking up pronunciation and fluency. So, even if you're a total beginner, you can use music to speed up and improve your language acquisition. Before we say goodbye, remember to like this video and subscribe for more great language learning content from LingoPi. You can sign up for a free 7-day trial with LingoPi by clicking the link below. Thanks for watching and I see you next time. Thank you.